Hey Greg, Capo2, like the recording. Here's some ideas I have in general with some hammer-ons. When you're holding G, I think you do this two-finger G with the pinky and the third finger, even if you don't. Uh, the note I would hammer-on on the G would probably be the first finger. I'm not sure what you're doing with the right hand. Uh, you can do a strummy thing. I'm kind of feeling this. Maybe alternate the bass, or just maybe... Check this out. You can do is maybe pick the fifth string. It's like a. Then I'm gonna go to E minor, maybe, and then C. I probably wouldn't do it all the time like this, but just to give an example. So let me try and play the recording actually real quick here and see. So something like that. Again, I'm probably doing it a little more now than I would, just to kind of give examples, but the G, the first finger. You can even do the fourth string. <laughs> even the third string, maybe. E minor, you could do the fifth string or the fourth. I think it's easier to lift both fingers. C. And the D, I noticed. I guess you could do a pull off on any of these too, like. Just whatever you have time for in the song, you know? Now if you're doing a finger picking thing, like a... It'd be a little more complicated to figure out where to put that in. Um, but that could work too. Or even a straight finger picking. tricky. I don't know to put the bass notes in with the finger picking. But let me know if any of that's close to what you're thinking and uh, maybe I can write something out for you if need be. But yeah, great song. Hope that helps.